Welcome to my it's recording. Yeah. Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Of course you know I'm interested in discovering my beautiful island in Jamaica. I found um maybe my soulmate <laughs> Mr. Black. Black X here and he has been discovering Jamaica over and over and over again and he has a mission for all of it he's been traveling for 10 years like finding all these wonderful gems about our country that we have forgotten about or don't even know about so I'm gonna have him tell his story Mr. Black X uh, you can talk to our people thank you very much um welcome bloggers bloggers vloggers, vloggers yeah. to the channel you know um, Black X, there, Taki Robinson from Outer St. Mary. Passing through, and we say, we we'll pass through and reach like Spur Tree. And we say, but I'm passing and see you, radio. No, courtesy, I have to come and stop. So I turn all the way back. A good work for come back, you know? <laughs> you know? And um, we are here now, and she wants that. So, yes, sir. A lot of things is my brain so just shoot up okay, myself. Okay, okay, okay. And um, just, yeah. you've been you've been doing this whole discovery of Jamaica for ten years. How are you doing it? On foot, on in, in boats, in cars, how are you doing it? Um I think it's a people by people. Um first of all, where you are, like NCU is here. So I come here, so I discover that yo, man the big <laughs> man the big. So th that is that is how it, it I'm interested in people and where people are. And so when you go where people are, then you, you begin to discover. That is all my, my, my initiative start discovering. As far as Taki is concerned, no, we want Taki to be a national hero. And tell, the, tell persons who Taki is for those who don't know. All right. Taki led the most awesome rebellion. We call it a war in 1760. One of the biggest slave uprisings, a, a blow against the slave establishment in 1760. And we do believe with all our hearts that he deserved to be a national hero for that, for the liberation movement, the moment. But I say for his vision, because when Taki came here from Africa, ship as, mm -hmm. a, as, a, as, a, as a slave. Right, right. We don't reach the Maroon Party. <laughs> and slavery was over 400 years old. So you were here, so when your band comes to band, comes to mm -hmm. band, so you can't change, that's when band comes to that. He had a concept for vision, for, for freedom. So I love to say that Taki had a concept of government before the United States had a president. Wow. That is the kind of man we're talking about. Because there was a high casualty rate. On the British side, they wanted to put him as less than human. But it's not that. Ten are we, twelve are we dead, and it's just... Mm -hmm. If two of them dead, then it's all over the room. I, I mean, it's a war. And when you're losing, your casualty is usually high. They were losing. That's why they lose some people. <laughs> I hear you. But this is awesome and I think this is something that we should definitely look into because many names have popped up over the years. You're saying Miss Lou, several other persons who could be added to our list of national heroes and, and you're not bringing to the fore Taki. And this is something to look into. Have you started a petition for that or anything? Yes, the, the petition is, is, is there. I mean, we have been doing this for 10 years, petition in the government. But it was before us. We just was started out supporting, we mean the Taki Heritage Group, supporting other people who were making the call. And it just that the support has come to the forefront. And it is well on its way, would love to say, very, very well on its way. But you still, after 10 years, you said, oh, can't just make it go like that. We have to do something significant for the 10 years. And bring it back, because unless you understand, the cameraman understand, and he's an household name, and household, like every household well, name. Well, once persons no. understand the, the, what Uba, he has Uba, done, right. Uba Mali is, yeah. Uba Marcus Garvey is, I mean, we never knew about Nani when Nani, you were not. Yeah. <laughs> when Nani became a national, but we were born. So for this, we want to teach people, let them aware, everyone aware, and then it will be. I wish I had more time you and will. I wish one day we could just do this walk together because I'm intrigued by that. I love hiking. I love Jamaica. Thank you so very much, Black X. And I'm sure that we'll see much more of you. You guys will see much more of him on Can I ask you a question? How far can you walk? Look here, brother. As long as there's road and I have my feet, the walk can go. And on and, and on and, and, and on. And the up makes Of course, with the water and all of that. Oh, yeah, man. We walk right all of that. Yeah, man. All Thank right. you very much for having me. I mean, it's fun up here. Really love up here. Uh, Pastor Woodburn, big up yourself. <laughs> big up yourself, Pastor Woodburn. Big up. I've never gone here and don't say hi to Pastor Woodburn. Good stuff. Thank you. And as we leave, though, I have to get up because I have to run off right now. Where's the most interesting place in Jamaica that you've discovered? The most interesting place in Jamaica. I think it's Jamaica. 
the whole place is just nice. I think nice. it's Jamaica. It's Jamaica again? Yeah. Jamaica again? Yeah. And Jamaica, yeah, you know, we're entering so, the so heritage so, season. Yeah, so, so you really have that because every nook and cranny has its sweet. Has its own beauty. That is true. Yes, yes. That and we don't, we don't prejudice. Ah, I we, like that. We've, we've suffered for what it is. All right. We've savored for what it is. I know. So Jamaica is beautiful. Thank you. Yes, sir. All right, then. Have a good day. Thanks, guys. Remember to like, subscribe, and share for more. Bye-bye. That was